Hello, everybody, and thank you for tuning into 1111 Synchronicity Tarot. I am back with another reading, and we're going to hop straight into it, okay? So we have a person here that's wanting marriage with you. This person here that's wanting marriage with you, they cannot stop thinking about you. Like none stop when they wake up, they thinking about you before they go to bed. They thinking about you. This person could be looking you up um, on your social media. They could be just looking at old text messages, pictures, um, and just thinking about the times you all maybe share with each other. Um, a movie here... Um, that kind of describe this connection is Love Jones. You could like Love Jones. This person could like the movie Love Jones. But in the movie, if you all haven't seen it, um, Darius Love Hall was the gentleman that pursued, that was trying to pursue uh, Nina Mosley. Okay, so he tried to talk to her and run her down and talk to her. Okay, and he finally got her to give him a, a chance and whatever and they start you know hanging out and whatever and it's like they tried to get something off the ground but it, it's like it ended she ended up moving i think to new york moving somewhere else so they was in different um states and it, it's kind of like he ended up going back to like an ex or he, or he was just like messing around with different women and whatever it's like he was in his energy to where he was trying to, I guess, play hard. Like, it really wasn't nothing or that big of a deal and all that kind of stuff. And But in actuality, he loved her. And so when she was leaving, I guess it became real to him because he was like, dang, she leaving. So he got on his motorcycle and tried to chase her down before she left, but she ended up leaving. And I think, like, a year or a little over a year had passed and whatever and she came back i think i guess seeing if she runs into him but both of them never stopped thinking about each other or loving each other during this separation and they ended up um uh, in the end they ended up reuniting with each other and they was like they was willing to make it work no matter whatever it takes and whatever so it's a good movie y'all okay but i think that this movie describes you all's connection to a t okay um this person could be trying to communicate with you and trying to come in and pick up where you all left out they could be calling you or texting you out the blue here um i feel like somebody here um could have been dealing with somebody that used men as a cover-up so if this person dealt with somebody they could have been dealing with somebody that was bisexual this person could be more into the opposite sex here i mean the they could be more into the the same sex here so if this person went towards a a karmic partner this person that they were with was secretly into women more than men so they could have used this person as a cover-up and just used them period here somebody could be having twins so they could find out that they're pregnant um with twins Yeah, this person is thinking about moving with you, having a family. This person could be thinking about just packing up whatever they have and, like, moving with you to a new place, a new location. This person feels like you all have grown apart from each other and they want to come in and heal this connection with you. This person could be thinking about um, taking you on, like, a romantic date or a trip or something. I'm definitely getting a really nice beautiful dinner date or something it could be people that know about you all's connection it could be people gossiping about it this per it could be people going to this person asking about you and i feel like this person is telling these people to mind their business when it comes to y'all yeah this person feel like they've been shot by cupid this person is in love with you this person definitely been thinking about you all living together like this person don't want to have this distance between you so if you all are living in different places and apart from each other this person doesn't like this distance like they want to be able to be around you each and every day so they definitely thinking about moving you all moving together getting a place together 
Um, this person sees you as a very grounded and balanced person. And if this is something that this person is currently working on for themselves, they want to be more like you, more grounded and balanced. This person sees you as a lover and a friend. They see you as everything in one. This person definitely sees you as someone that they could make money with and have a really nice life with. You all having businesses together and making money together. So lovers, friends, and business partners is how this person sees with you. And they're ready to come in and marry you. For some of them, they're going to come in and on this dinner date, they could like propose to you or get, you know, or like give you you know some type of offer for a commitment or something this person sees you as magical someone out of this world a lot of you all could be psychics um or something like that this person is saying please don't take your love away they don't want you to walk away um from them they are holding on to this connection for a dear life here so even if you all been in separation this person is constantly thinking about you and they're praying that you don't meet somebody else you know before they come in because this person sees you as their forever person this person sees you as very pure very innocent this person is currently in deep regret for not believing in you and in this connection in the beginning like i feel like this person had a lot of people in their ear could have been friends family um this person could have just had different addictions and um could have kind of been childish and and you know kind of immature in the beginning and they just could have listened to other people instead of following their own heart but this person is in deep regret for not following their own intuition and their heart in the beginning because this person always loved you it's just they cared about how people would view you all they cared about how other people um uh, think way too much okay they were in their head a whole lot when it came to this connection and they hate that they didn't give you what you deserve in the beginning this person definitely want to have a baby with you they see you as being a really good mother here so it did say having twins so when this person come in if you take this person back um i definitely see you getting pregnant here this person definitely want i feel like want a baby with you but somebody definitely could be finding out that they having twins or something like that um this person saying that you can have whatever you want this person want to come in and give you whatever you want even though you coming off as this person that does everything on your own this person feels like you deserve to have someone to come in and do something for you for a change because i feel like you all you all are the type of person that never asks for anything and you over give and it's like you never get what you put out and this person just want to come in and give you what you've been putting out they feel like you deserve that and this person want to give you that they want to give you whatever it is that you want um yeah, this person loves you with all of their heart here. And like now this person don't care who knows that they love you. In the past, you know, they might have wanted to keep things a secret and they might have tried to hide their feelings and hide how much they truly, truly loved you and all of that kind of stuff. But they're not wanting, they don't want to do that anymore. They don't care who knows that they love you. When they come in, I'm telling you, they're going to be ready when they come in. They're going to be ready to like, have this higher level commitment or marriage or whatever in the beginning this person said that they hate that that they wasn't ready to love you properly they was fighting demons so this person was in a very low vibrational state this person had toxic friends around them they just had toxic people around them that kept them in this low vibrational state a lot of people around them didn't uh want what was really best for this person they uh praised this person for being in this toxic energy because this person you know could have had people around them just this toxic okay but this person is realizing um what they had did what they have done in the past and you know they're ready to correct those things here to get a second chance here with you this person is very inspired by you they admire your strength here you all could be very strong very wise um they feel like you're the one for them definitely and this person is proud of your growth this person is watching you so whatever it is that you're doing they're watching you and they're proud of you you all could be in sync with each other so however this person is feeling you could currently be feeling as well this person was scared of commitment in the beginning they were scared to love this person could have possibly been hurt by somebody and they could have had their heart closed off where they never wanted to commit again to someone else or this person was just had um 
issues that they dealt with as a kid where they didn't know how to love they didn't know what love was so they couldn't give it and they didn't know how to uh reciprocate that love okay and you know they didn't know how to um accept love but this person is ready now they're ready to commit this person really want to be with you and this person feels like no matter what happens between you all you will always be theirs no matter what yeah and this person here they see you as this queen of cups here they see you as someone that's attractive practical romantic emotional someone that's honest you you know you could be very good with money sympathetic um uh, this person just feels like you have a very uh positive effect you know over their life you have definitely came into this person's life and it's been like an eye opener you you i feel like caused this person to um heal wanted to be better here yeah this person you could make this person nervous here with your energy here okay you could definitely make this person uh nervous but this person has a whole lot of passion for you this person finds you sexy seductive they see you as very attractive you're a very um attractive and they want to rush in um and they want to definitely give you this um offer here this person could definitely um want to uh just come in and be vulnerable with you and let their wall down and just finally tell you how they truly feel because this person wore a mask and they held all of these feelings and all this love that they had for you they just held it inside they just held it they knew that they always had feelings for you which is why that card came out love jones because this person i felt like wanted to talk to you for the longest and they finally got your attention and it's like once they got your attention and your love, they didn't know what to do with it. <laughs> they like, okay, uh, now I got it. What do I do? And they didn't do right with it, okay? So this person, um, you know, now they're like, oh, my God, how could I have, you know, done that? How did I let this good thing walk away? So now, you know, they like, uh-uh, I got to get my person back. Um, <laughs> yeah, this person feel like it's a strong um love between you two this person sees you as an inspiration here this person feels like you're like a dream come true you're the type of person where it's like it's almost like it's too good to be true this person could have thought you were full of shit or something like this person could have thought you were trying to play them because they like wait a minute how a person looks nice they're attractive this person is loving how are they all these things what's the catch what this person trying to do i feel like this person could have thought that you were trying to play them because they like ain't ain't nobody this good especially they look nice and they good like this person could have definitely looked at you as too good to be true and they could have thought that you was trying to play them but now they see that this is just who you are okay and they not they know that a person like you don't come by too often so they that's why they want to come in and give you this offer because they know that they might not meet anyone else like you ever again yeah this is definitely someone from your past here this person is definitely thinking about um the happy times you all shared this person definitely could be grieving and sad because of the loss of you you know um a lot of you all could have walked away and just let this go because this person didn't know what they wanted or you know they wore this mask and they didn't come to you and and to tell you how they truly felt they hid their feelings from you and they was very in and out and cold you know towards you so you all walked away because this person in the beginning wasn't giving you what it is that you deserve and this person you know they're very regretful for not giving their all into this connection here um but this person they hoping for a better future here and they're hoping that they can come in and reconcile and show you that they can be the man that you need yeah this person loves you he's in love with you okay yeah this person is definitely manifesting you back um this person could see you as a person here um uh, this very magical okay like whatever it is that you want they see you as the type of person that can get it you 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 all could be a very good manifester um this person definitely want to have a new beginning with you and a family with you here this person definitely could be coming in and trying to get you pregnant when they come in they definitely could talk to you about having kids with you they want to come in and they want to balance things out and heal with you they want to give you equal give and take this person is ready this person now has gained the strength to come in 
to take this leap of faith and come towards you now even though you might be very intimidating okay <laughs> this person is is ready and they're willing to put in the work to have this beautiful connection with you here okay but that is all I have for you all today. I hope that this reading has gave you some type of clarity. And I hope that it resonated in some way. And I don't want to forget. <laughs> um, I am now accept I'm now doing uh, personal readings. So if you all would like a personal reading from me, you can email me at 1111 synchronicity tarot at gmail.com. You can send payments in to uh, PayPal at a Stewart three seven six. My cash shop is eleven eleven Sync Tarot, and my Venmo is April underscore Stewart eleven eleven. All this information is in the description box. So that is all, y'all. Bye.